What a glorious, glorious morning. Please help, guys. I'm stuck in this alternate reality where we have to vlog 24-7. I put out one vlog a week. What are you talking it's about? torture. Please help. Time to clock oh. in. Oh, Time to clock in. I don't know. This is a weird conversation. This is so I'm gonna be so awesome. Not really. By the way, my favorite. Mike sucks ass, so it's amazing to watch him. So last night we went to a dinner at my favorite restaurant in LA. Lana enjoyed the dinner so much. Wait, wait, wait. You really want to talk about this on here? Also, they insulted me at the door and told me- They assaulted her at the door. <laughs> Your eyes look like an icy blue landscape that I just want to ice skate on. You can. What if I told you it would just cost you a penny? I think a lot of you people probably wonder, what is on the floor of Lana Rhodes' bedroom? Well, I'll show you right now. A set of slutty angel wings. <laughs> Old Shake Shack. Some dysfunctional running shoes with barbecue sauce all over them. That's my phone. Oh, she knows the code to my phone now. She figured it out. I got it on the second guess. Your password was so fucking easy. What do you like to do now? Well, I haven't abused my power yet, but I'm thinking sometime whenever you're sleeping. <laughs> well, look who it is. My ex-assistant, Olivia, once again. Where are you going, Olivia? Guess you're too busy for my tasks now. This is the hamster that you lost, right? Yeah, it's Pian. He's the best thing that ever happened to me, honestly. The second best thing or the best thing? Definitely the best. I'll see you in a bit, Las Vegas. Bye, baby. I'll meet you there. I'm gonna win us a bunch of money, and then we're gonna get married, and we're gonna have five babies. Bye, babe. All right, guys, welcome back to the night shift. You're working late and so are we. It's time to clock in. As I'm sure you guys remember, a couple episodes ago, me and Lana took that trip to New York City so that she could become a stripper again. Well, now tonight she's back at it, but this time it's in Las Vegas. We're all heading out there to support Lana. But before we get into the rest of today's vlog, I did want to sit here in the beautiful night shift studio and also take a second to give away a piece of night shift apparel, which is available at shopthenightshift.com right now. I'm going to give one of these hoodies away to somebody that comments below on this video. Also, I'm starting to see some of the designs for the next drop. They're absolutely crazy. You guys are gonna fucking go nuts over them. All right, Chef Katie, what's for breakfast? Uh, brisket and eggs. God dang, look at that. What is this sauce? It's a red wine sauce for the brisket. Fried Why? So you feel better about yourself. <laughs> oh, well, look who it is. I'm your biggest fan. That's not true. It's definitely my mom. I'm your second biggest there fan. There you go. I want to go fast. NASCAR. <laughs> I'm going to come at you like a spider monkey. Can I ask you a question? What? Are you feeling all right today? I'm feeling great. Right. Buying you vitamin water and looking at when you need to leave for the airport. You're a multitasker. Multitasking. I got to get out of here before he starts filming me. Oh. Who eats toast with a fucking fork, dude? Psychopaths. Me, really? Me. What's good? Shane Dawson, come back. Bro, bro. We need to do another documentary immediately. <laughs> this is the biggest proof of all time that he's a fucking sociopath. He eats toast with a fucking fork. Mike, I don't judge you for having that stupid hat on your shoulders. I don't judge you for being short. Tempered. Short tempered, short tempered. Oh. You're gonna come with me to the club tonight to watch Lana perform. And she's also bringing a bunch of bad bitches from Vegas. What are the chances that you <laughs> slip your pooter in their tutor? Zero. I, my libido is low, dude. Like, I, I'll go for content. Are you depressed? Yeah. Are you repressed? Yeah. Are, have you been repossessed? No, no. Yo, David can fuck all Lana's friends. I wanna be there. Oh my god, yeah. Uh, Bro, Jeff. Yeah. Where the fuck's our scripted reality show? Mike, just turn the camera around. That is Jeff! <laughs> so, Jeff? A million views, Mike. They have to go to work. You just turn a camera on yourself. And yeah, but <laughs> he's right. Fucking A, Jeff. Yeah. Logan, did you see what happened last time she danced at the one in New York? Yeah, she, she, did, she did a good deed. She did a good deed, and she threw all of the money that she made during the dance back onto the other girls who are having like a slower night. I'm interested to see if she'll do it again. Does your phone ring all day? It rings a lot. What's your favorite type of tea? Camomile. What is your favorite Spanish music artist? J Balvin. <laughs> J Alvarez. <laughs> are you gonna gamble in Vegas this time? Oh um, yeah. If you could hook up with one influencer in LA, who would it be? I don't know if that's that's for me, bro. If you could take away one influencer you've hooked up with in LA, who would yeah, it be? Probably Corona. <laughs> you wore that same shirt to the Lakers game you guys went to. <laughs> I'd love to take you guys on food tours here on the night shift. This place is called Grimaldi's. It's some of the best pizza I've ever had in my Nah, it's the best. The best pizza he's ever had in his life. Maybe one day, Mike. You cannot beat Grimaldi's. It's the original pizza. They made the Brooklyn Bridge famous, and this is what it's all about right here. This is Logan Paul, and definitely he likes to brawl. We'll see how MMA goes in his life. You never know, but look at him now. He's ready. Oh! 
So that was an incredible dinner. Yes. We ate with Bruce Buffer, Paulo Costa, and Henry Cejudo. UFC legends. Legends. Right? So Henry Cejudo, it's two belts. And you got to hold the UFC belt. How did it feel? Amazing. Yeah, I'll never have it ever, so it was cool. Don't, don't speak it out of existence. Is it going to happen? You it's think not, I'm a bit? Yeah, it's what? It's not going to happen. Nah. There she is. Hi. Hi. Can I have are you, what are you mad at me about right now? What did I do now? I texted you. And said what? What I had the Postmates getting for us. Oh. And you didn't respond. And then you were watching everyone else's stories and reposted one of us, but you couldn't respond to your sweet little girlfriend who's been sitting here all day waiting for you. What if we take all of the money that you get on stage tonight, including the money that me and Logan throw on you, and then we bet it all on one number on roulette. And if it hits, it pays 35 to one. Yeah, let's do it. Your eyes look incredible right now. You look incredible right now. You're gonna crush it tonight. Babe, I think you're forgetting something. Oh, come on! Fucking motherfucker. Ah, uh, yes, I'm here to apply for the uh, management position. What are you looking for in your candidate today? Um, you have to be black and have a big bed. I'll see you later. It was nice to uh, <laughs> I hope you guys have a great business. All right, so here's the plan. We got a bunch of fucking singles here. We're gonna throw them all on the stage. Lana is gonna match whatever she gets with what we throw at her, and then we're taking all the money and putting it on one number on roulette. That seems fucking dumb. Let's what? do it! Yes. The question is, what number? Six. Sounds like sex. Wait, are you sure? Yeah, six. Either nine or six. Six and nine are your numbers. Sixty-nine are your fucking numbers. No, they you know my birthday. That's kind of fucked up, Mama. No, my birthday's nine six, nineteen ninety-six. I was born nine point six ounces at nine oh six a.m. Are you cool with six? I'm not sure she had a birthday. I'll feature you tonight. A lot of rolls in the house. Money on me was my friend. <laughs> we have $1,157. We're gonna go bet this on number six black. If it comes up, we'll win roughly 40 grand. Off a thousand dollars? Off a thousand dollars. So let's go fucking do it, all right? Let's do it. We got the money right here. I'm gonna walk to that table right there. I'm gonna put all of it on six right now. We can't film the table, but I'll be back in one second. I'll let you know if we want. <laughs> all right, so here's the deal. Not even fucking close. It was quite literally the furthest number it could possibly be from a 632. We lost. We're going to get more money. That's it for tonight's episode of the Night Shift. Clock it the fuck out. Sucks.